It's time now for Chatting with the Stars. A fight over church brings estranged brothers together in the new film, God's Not Dead, A Light in the Darkness. I wanted to hear all about it, so I sat down with the stars of the film. Take a look. All right, we are here to talk about their new movie, God's Not Dead, A Light in the Darkness. John Corbett and David A.R. White, hello. Hello. <laughs> All right, David, church and state collide in God's Not Dead, A Light in the Darkness. Should religion play a role in politics? What's great about this film is that it's authentic. You know, we've certainly been living in this dark, social, political, divisive time. How do we bring about unity? How do we bring about uh, compassion? How do we get along? That's what this film is about, and that's what we're hoping to, hoping to show on Easter weekend. Now, this is the third film in the franchise. How does the latest installment sort of represent the world we're living in today, like you were speaking about? I play a pastor in the film. Our father built this church, built this, you know, this this uh, university that ends up getting turned over to the state. All of a sudden, our church burns down. Mm. Now the university says we don't need the church anymore. And so, who does the pastor call in any great movie? He calls his brother to help, who happens to be an atheist. What you're doing, it's against the law. We're wasting our time here. John, how is it like playing an atheist? Everything you need is right there in the script. Usually, you know, that's the fun part of acting is make believe uh, that you're mad at somebody for a day. I like that part the best. All right, John, your Sex in the City co-star Kyle <laughs> McLaughlin said recently that you hang out on set while wearing pink fuzzy slippers. Did these slippers make an appearance on set in this latest film and are you wearing them now? Of course. I, do I have my slippers on? No, I don't. It's raining here, so I have boots on right now. But he's now. got his red Christmas socks on yeah. with oh, those boots. Oh, that counts. That totally counts. My dad was a welder, and he said, son, whenever you have to do a job, make sure you're comfortable. <laughs> so that's why I wear the slippers. slippers. All right, <laughs> Cynthia Nixon is running for governor. Would you vote for her? I vote for anybody in politics that I happen to know because... Uh, <laughs> That, that's rare. That's rare that I know anyone. So if I've met him, I, if I met him once, I consider him a buddy of mine. If I meet a celebrity once, yeah. I'll see him on TV and go, hey, there's my buddy. Thank you guys so much for chatting with us. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Check out our film. See you Easter later. Weekend. Bye. Thanks for watching Daily Blast Live. Did you know that we are live on YouTube every weekday for three and a half hours? Did you also know that we upload exclusive new video like crazy? Stuff like breaking news, celebrity interviews, viral videos, new apps, new food, new perspectives on the world we live in right as it's happening. So please subscribe and check out some more videos. Go ahead. We'll wait. <laughs>